always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. Well, what a weekend. We certainly had to dodge some showers, especially in the afternoon. Some of those downpours are pretty hefty, too. We are going to steer clear of that over the next couple of days. So a, ni a nice live look outside. This is currently over Middleville. And you can see that we have just a, full, a few clouds that are streaming through, but not many. And plenty of sunshine brought to you by an area of high pressure. Temperatures are in the 70s. They're going to be falling into the mid-50s tonight. And even though we're completely clear out there currently, this is Muskegon, for example, we are going to watch for some areas of fog to develop. So as we slide down tonight, we are going to drop down close to dew point. The wind is going to settle down, and that's going to allow a couple of hours where we have to watch for some patchy fog. It will give way to sunshine by the time we get to 9 a.m. So you can see the temperatures dropping into the mid-50s. Keep that in mind if you are headed back to school tomorrow. But tomorrow afternoon is going to be so pleasant. Plenty of sunshine highs once again topping out in the low 80s. And tomorrow we are not going to have to watch for any pop-up showers and storms. So if I move out of the way here, you can see the area of low pressure that's moving towards New England. That's what passed through our area here the last couple of days. So around it, there are the rain and shower and storm chances. Meanwhile, we're seeing high pressure move in. So our storm chances drop off to incredibly low values for the next several days. We have a cold front off to our north, clouds for the upper peninsula. Meanwhile, locally, high pressure just continues to mosey on through at a very slow rate. That means it's going to be a nice quiet middle of the week for us. And we don't start to see the activity uptick until we get later into the weekend. Here's a look at Storm Track Live currently. And again, nice and dry, just a few showers over near Detroit. We are going to start to see a few showers move in for Thursday. And then again, trending towards the weekend, we'll have to watch for the heat to build and another chance for showers and storms late. So the good news is if you're trying to soak up the last bits of summer, the weather is cooperating. If you're headed out to the lakeshore, waves are going to be less than a foot. Water temperatures have rebounded into the 60s and the low 70s, and we're expecting plenty of sunshine. Here's the eight-day forecast for you. Again, Sunday into Monday, we get another chance of some showers. It will be kind of on the humid side for Sunday into Monday as well. But all in all, this entire stretch is really seasonable and it's sparing us from big heat waves or humidity instances. So some touches of humidity here and there. We expect that for summertime. We've just really been lucking out for the month of August. Yes. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Ellen, thank, thank you. Thank you, Ellen.